I dress the part today. I'm just saying. You, you do. Know? You I look mean, nice in spring like <laughs> Sony. You. Spring I'm yesterday. stuck in winter. You know, it, that's what this month has been like, though. Last week felt like winter. I remember riding the bike into work and had ice pellets hitting me in the face. Mm -hmm. I'm like, what is going on? It's April in Chicago. That's what's going on. Milder today and beautiful outside. Uh, we are seeing uh, quite a bit of warmth out there compared to yesterday's high of 71 degrees at O'Hare and 73 at Midway. We're at 59 degrees currently at O'Hare. Areas downtown already in the low end of the 60s and uh, quite mild in areas in northwest Indiana as well. Uh, right now we're kind of between two weather systems. We've got one to the north of us kind of across the Great Lakes and that weather system is drawing in those westerly winds uh, that's keeping us on the mild side. The next weather system system is actually down to the south, already firing off showers and thunderstorms in parts of East Texas and parts of Oklahoma. This weather system developing here in East Texas is going to be heading our way as we get into tomorrow, but not during the day necessarily. We'll just see those increasing clouds. It's when we get later towards the afternoon, the clouds will thicken up and then the rain starts to move in as we get towards later Wednesday and into Thursday, which does look like our soggiest day of the week. So in between today and most of the day tomorrow, definitely can be taken advantage of getting out and about and enjoying some of that sun. Sunshine. Upper level wind pattern though is going to keep us a little cool for as we are, our incursion of rain as we get towards Thursday. Uh, system moving in, we see this dip in the jet stream. We call that a trough. So we'll see kind of unsettled weather Thursday into the first part of Friday. And Thursday looks like our coolest day of the week with temperatures uh, back down towards normal, but at least normal, not below normal like we were for almost all of last week. Temperatures look to surge as we get towards the weekend. Warmer weather developing on the plains. It really starts to move in as we get towards the beginning part of next week. So Monday and Tuesday could actually be well above normal. Live a view from Northwestern University campus. Things looking beautiful. A little bit of hazy sunshine as we see from Evanston. Temperature again upper end of the 50s and the winds have been picking up through most of the morning. So we do have that brisk wind going on. So it's not quite it's an easy day necessarily because it does feel a little colder when the wind is going on. So maybe a light uh, jacket will be helpful for, for the afternoon, but also the sunglasses. Wind gusts have been peaking out. It's probably around, say, 25, 30 miles an hour. We're seeing that right now. And in that future outlook, we do see uh, as we get towards uh, Tuesday afternoon through the later part of the day, uh, some of the high clouds go away. So a little more of that blue sky we're expecting tomorrow though lay out of clouds in this forecast model looks like towards southern Chicago land. You see a little more of the cloud cover more of the sun up to the north, but the clouds will fill in the skies as we get through the day. So by the time we get towards lunchtime tomorrow, we see pretty cloudy skies, but the temperature should still be relatively mild. We're looking mid 60s, a little bit of an easterly wind looks to develop off the lake. So places along the lakefront a little bit cooler than the mid 60s. Most of us are going to see for tomorrow. Looking towards tomorrow night, we start to see the first raindrops moving in probably after dinner time on Wednesday, but they stay with us all the way through the overnight hours and really soggy Monday or Thursday morning commute with those winds coming out of the northeast. It makes things a little cooler as well, and that rain looks to continue into Thursday and maybe even the first part of Friday. But for today, partly cloudy skies continued mild 66. That's not too bad. That's 10 degrees above normal for this time of the year. Not quite as mild and gorgeous as yesterday, but hey, we'll take it tonight. Overnight lows settling down towards about 44 in the city. Again, that's normal than a, a typical overnight low, which is around 38 degrees. We will likely get into the 30s, at least the upper 30s in some of the far western portions of Chicagoland. But tomorrow, a nice day, not perfect. We'll see increasing clouds, so uh, sort of the cloud cover could make you uh, a little bit on the downside, but the chance of evening showers comes back into play. As we see, uh, definitely a soggy day on Thursday. High temperature about 57 will be much cooler, but that's not uh, too bad for the season. That's about typical. We start warming things back up getting into the weekend Saturday around 70 a little cooler by the lake and then Sunday up towards the mid to upper end of the 70s so uh, maybe some spots at least a little bit further down state might even crack 80 degrees so yeah. we're watching them pretty closely but uh, so far so good as we finally start to warm things up for this spring quite earnestly around here. I'm right? ready. That's beach I'm ready. weather. Yeah. That is water beach temperature is still about 45 degrees. Uh, well, just don't go in the water just, just go to the beach. Yeah. yeah. Thanks Jim. <laughs>